Hey, YouTube, we hit it again. We are still out here in the country club, the Eagles Landing. I remember to put my mic in this time, <laughs> so the audio going to be a lot clearer. But I know I said in the last video, the other one had better curb appeal, but I think it's more so the paint, that, that black and cream stucco, because this house is really nice. Four-sided brick with the stucco. It ain't got the turnaround. Well, I guess it do. I guess this would be considered a turnabout uh, driveway. You can come in, it ain't a full circle, but you see how I come in, they got the circle right there. And come around here, side garage, large parking pad in the front and on the side, three car garage. We are in Eagles Landing, so it's a luxury house again. This is five bedrooms, four baths, 4,473 square feet, 0.6 acres. I'm finna do this in my house. Just gotta get this concrete. I don't got the right kind of gold, but we're gonna make it work. I got the gold that came with the bottom. I'm just gonna take it off the bottom and cement it in the ground. I don't know how it's gonna work, but we finna see. <laughs> but 0.6 acres. This one ain't on the ain't on the golf course. So I don't know if that's a positive or a negative. You know what I don't see in Eagles Landing? Of all the houses I've done, I'm gonna go back through them. All the ones I done recorded out here in Eagles Landing. What you don't see, no one has a privacy fence. I don't know if the HOA don't allow you to have one or just no one feels the need to have one because you inside of the country club, gated community, all that good stuff. Like, I don't know. I'm going to check and see because I ain't never seen one. Oh, they had a nice little garden. All in the neighbor's yard again. I like the way they had their backyard set up. Their backyard look nice. You put up a fence. I ain't seen a lot of them. But I've never seen a privacy fence in Eagles Landing. But nah, I was I was wrong with this. The curb appeal for this is nice too. Some satellites need to be taken down. Other than that, I'm liking this. Outside, inside. Had to peek in here and make sure there no photos in here either. This one empty. This one is empty. The third one I was going to do is filled with furniture too, so I ain't going to do that one. Not going to do that one. I'm going to send them these two. If they like these two, I'll tell them about the third one. If they come back up here, then we're going to look at it. But I ain't going to record the third one. I think they're in like southern Georgia. They said close to, uh, I don't know if they said close to Tennessee or close to Alabama. I didn't know it was it was down there. Or would it be northern Georgia? I don't know. <laughs> I know Atlanta. <laughs> it's terrible. I know Augusta. I'm good with Augusta. And Warrington and all that type of stuff. Once you get outside of that, I don't, I don't know too much. Griffin. I know a lot of people don't like this, but I, I, I don't know. It's, I kind of like that. You walk in, you see the big stairwells push back. I don't like that. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Like that, or would you like the stairs to be farther away from the front door? I sleep like that one. Most houses I don't. Get some light. A little dark. This, I think, will be a dining room. I'm quoting. <laughs> we gonna see. We gotta walk through here and check it out. I can't find the light switches. There we go. We got some light. Okay, so I think dining room. Not a hundred percent sure. What's this? Is that the way to the basement? Ah, I like that. Is this the way to the basement? No, this is the half a bathroom. Okay. So we got half a bath. I guess we'll come this way. Don't understand that. That can't be where they had the TV. Can't be. What do they have right there? I don't know. That's a little weird. Don't know what that is. But this is your family room. Real high ceilings. The windows. You know, they like the windows. You got your catwalk. House was built in 1999, so catwalk got the little crib bars on it. They got the TV wired up here. So what was that? I don't know what that was, but TV wire right here. They had a TV right there. 
What do they have right here? Mm -hmm. It look like a just gas. I don't see the gas thing for it. That might be wood burning. Wood burning fire. Nope, gas is right there. The gas fireplace. What's this? Basement. No. Oak lights. Where's the basement? We're gonna go over there. We're gonna come this way. So this will be a keeping room. Your breakfast nook, keeping room all together. Oh, would this be like a little sitting area? Sitting area, dining room. Oh, would that be the sitting area. This is the dining room. And this is the breakfast nook. That's him much I think. Kitchen been upgraded as you can see. Kitchen has been upgraded. Gas yeah, stove, cooktop, double ovens. Or oh, is this a microwave? That's a microwave. <laughs> That's a cool microwave. <laughs> The microwave cool. I like that. Okay. I didn't know that was a microwave. That's a small cutout for a refrigerator. I don't know. I slip. It, it, it's a little shorter than me, so I guess not. Oh, you can just take this off. I don't see the purpose of it anyway. You take the top piece off. But now nah, this won't have no support. I don't know. That I probably changed this around. I don't think this always was refrigerated because it's a phone jack. For you younger people, it used to be wall phones that you plugged into here and hooked to the wall and had cord on it. I know. Crazy, right? <laughs> a lot of cabinet space. Yeah, so you can see this been done recently. A stairway over here, stairway over there. I wonder if there's one on this side too. Nah, it's just two. It's just two. I'm right down through here. It's a bedroom now. Let's check this bedroom out. That look like the basement right there. Bedroom number one. Is this the primary? Don't tell me it's the primary. I ain't want to do the primary first. Primary on the main floor is always a plus. Ooh, it's a big room. Yeah, I think it's the primary. Yeah, this is a really big room. Yeah, the outside access got its own little porch. I don't think it's shared porch with the front. Yep, not a shared porch. <laughs> it's shared porch. I thought it had its own private little porch. Okay. So I'm thinking it's the primary on the main floor. Always a plus. I didn't know it was here. I would have did this last. I'm not here. Lights. It's your linen closet. <laughs> Louis Vuitton, I wonder if they're giving it away. It's just a box. I said, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Light switch. Just the light switch. Yep. Got his and her closets. Oh, they pull out. <laughs> kind of cool. Let's do the same thing. Yep. Okay, this is hers. <laughs> the other one here is the little closet. And this one is hers. Know how they go, fellas. This look cool. I like that. I'm going to set a primary bathroom. Tiled all the whole bathroom tiled out. Jacuzzi tub. Double vanity. Is. Hers. Chow a little low. Like I said, that's relative to my height. I'm six foot three, so it's a little low for me. But like normal people is about perfect size. Like my head over this. I don't know if I can show it. Let me see. Yeah, my head is over the front. Y'all ain't gonna be able to see me. I don't think that worked out how I thought it was gonna work out. <laughs> Cut these lights out as I go. I don't know how I cut that one off. Right. How I cut that one off? I ain't never come down here, did I? Okay. What is this light for? Nothing. It probably won't work 
probably work that switch right there. Okay, so it's bedroom number one, bathroom one and a half. We got one full bathroom, half a bath down here. Basement. No, two car garage, <laughs> three car garage. We're gonna find the basement eventually. How old the heater look? Fairly new. It ain't got no expansion tank on it though. So when they sell it, it's gonna pop up on the uh, inspection report. They gotta put an expansion tank on it. Three car garage. That's something small though. I don't think they cost that much to put the expansion tank on it. I think about a hundred, two hundred dollars selling the house this price. Two hundred dollar expansion tank shouldn't shouldn't break it. Once again, let's try basement. No, laundry room. Do it have a basement? I don't think it don't have a basement. I think it's just 4,473 square feet, just straight up. I don't think it has a basement. Pantry. No. It don't have a basement. It's on the flat. This is a really big house there. It's on the flat. I mean, these rooms huge. 4,400 square feet, straight up. Ah, that's different. I slick like it. You got a bedroom halfway up the stairs. Okay. So I'm a little play area. You got closets in here? Ain't no closet, so this ain't counting as a bedroom. You put closet doors right here. Make that a closet, and you got your bedroom. But this this a gym. It's the gym with the pool table. Pool table right here in this little open area. So you got enough space for it, put a little TV up there so we can watch our little sports and stuff while we play. This is it. It's the play area. Put a closet back there, it's a bedroom. When you come upstairs, you got a lounge or another living room. Me, this would be my son's little room. This would be his, his living room. Don't come in my living room. It's yours. I sleep might even be funny. You get him like a corner in here. <laughs> Put the pool table in here, all workout equipment in there just to be mean. He don't care. He's coming and shooting pool with me, so he don't care. I don't like these tubs. I know I saw in one video, I was like, this is a unique feature you can do. I don't know. The more I see it, the less I like it. Plastic tubs. I thought they don't like those. They come into a bedroom? Yep. So it's bedroom number two. Unless they count in that big room as a bedroom. They count in that big room, which don't have a closet as a bedroom. It's bedroom three. We'll see when we get finished, though. Whether or not they count in there. So it's either two or three. Come up here. Got your catwalk. Like I said, I love the catwalks. TV right there. Ooh, it's like it was a theater at one point. It's fire. I like this. It's better on three or four. I like this. With the little step up. I like this one. I like the way they got the closet. I know some people don't like this. It'd be a waste of space when they be putting all this stuff in the closet. I love it. It's a good way to keep the closet organized for me. Okay, so I like this room. That's different. I don't know. That one little step made me like the room. <laughs> that's, I like weird stuff. So that's either bedroom three or bedroom four. Bathroom. I said, the more I see this, the less I like it. I saw it for the first time on, on that new construction house. I was like, oh, that's a good idea. You know what I mean? We can do this when we start flipping, but the more I see it, the less I like it. Y'all tell me if I'm tripping or not. Eh, this is size bedroom. Nah, this is a fairly large bedroom. <laughs> you for the king in here, easy. Fairly large bedroom. <laughs> Fucking closet. So, yeah, because this is either bedroom five or bedroom six. I mean, bedroom four or bedroom five. We're going to count them again. Make sure. As we go downstairs. Okay, so this is one. This is two. This 
This is three. And the one downstairs is four. They count that as a bedroom. So five. They don't got no closet, so when they do the appraisal, it's not gonna come back as a bedroom. But they count that as a bedroom. Come down this way with the double doors. I don't like that. How would you change that? I have to pay somebody for that. I won't be able to do that myself. That's too high up. And it's right here on the steps. I won't be able to do that. They did a lot. They did. I ain't going to say they did a lot of renovation. Well, yeah. You can say they did a lot of renovation because a lot of this stuff, it was built in 1999. A lot of this stuff looked fairly new. Now let's fix this camera up so I can talk to you guys. Got my mic on so y'all can hear me better. Ooh. Like I said in the last video, recording these for some clients that want this neighborhood more so than the house. Like the house is a bonus to them. The neighborhood is the actual goal. So I'm going to send them both of these houses. I wanted to send them the third one, but they got too much furniture in it. But like I said in every video, like, subscribe, share, comment. Give me y'all opinions of the house. Tell me what y'all would do different. Like, what would you change? What would you do different? How would you renovate it if you wanted to renovate it? What you don't like about the house? Talk to me in the comments. I see all the comments. I don't mind negative comments. But this house is going for $695,000. A lot of y'all going to say that's too high. But you got to remember what area you in. You are in Eagles Landing Country Club. This is one of the premier neighborhoods in Metro Atlanta. So houses are going to be a lot more expensive. You got some houses in here that's like one, two, one point two million dollars, one point three million dollars. So this is on the cheaper end of the houses in this neighborhood. So yeah, You're paying for the neighborhood, not just the house. Country club, I think one ninety a month. But till next time, YouTube. We out of here.